Africa Twin Adventure Sports ES is truly exceptional. It offers more mid-range torque for strong overtaking acceleration. With a 19-inch front wheel and a 11080-19 tire, along with a lower seat height and Showa EI electronic suspension, this bike delivers impeccable on-road handling. The new fairing and screen provide wind protection, allowing riders to make the most of the 24.8L fuel tank and enjoy long days on the road. This bike is built for those kinds of adventures. In 2025, the CRF 1100L Africa Twin Adventure Sports undergoes a significant update. This includes updated chassis dynamics with a new 19-inch front wheel, increased power and torque for the engine, further DCT refinements, and a more muscular new look. These changes further enhance the model. The 1,084 cubic centimeters, 8-valve parallel twin engine now produces 75 kilowatts at 7,500 rpm, with peak torque increasing to 112 newton meters at 5,500 rpm, up from 105 newton meters at 6,250 rpm. The ball remains at 92 millimeters with an 81.5 millimeters stroke. The compression ratio has been increased to 10.5 to 1 from 10.1 to 1. There are noticeable improvements in both power and torque, particularly at lower revs and through the mid-range compared to the previous model. The 2025 Africa Twin Adventure Sports shares the frame and engine of the more off-road focused Africa Twin, but it has a distinct purpose, to provide riders with real continent crossing long-haul capability and practicality both on and off-road. In 2025, a 19-inch front wheel will be used instead of a 21-inch one. It will have a wider 11080-19 tire instead of the previous 1990-21 tire. This change will result in better grip and feedback from the front tire, leading to improved on-road stability and comfort, especially when the vehicle is fully loaded. The seat will have a revised cushion thickness to enhance comfort and will be set lower at 835, gate 55 mm. Additionally, the suspension stroke, both front and rear, will be reduced to 210, 200 mm, which will improve on road handling and ensure better stability when the vehicle reaches the ground. In order to improve acceleration, especially when carrying two people and full cargo, the 1,084 cubic centimeters parallel twin cylinder engine has been adjusted to generate more torque at low and mid-range speeds. It now produces 112 newton meters at its peak without any loss of power, which remains at 75 kilowatts. The DCT, dual clutch transmission, has been improved to provide a more natural feel during initial pull-away and at very low speeds. It is equipped with a 6-axis inertial measurement unit IMU, that controls not only the 7-level Honda Selectable Torque Control HSTC, but also 3-level wheelie control, cornering ABS with an off-road setting, rear lift control and DCT cornering detection. There are 4 default riding modes, Urban, Tour, Gravel and Off-Road. The riding position is designed for complete control with a slim seat that has increased cushion thickness for added comfort and high set handlebars. The motorcycle features dual LED daytime running lights DRL, with three-stage cornering lights that adjust the field of illumination based on the lean angle, providing better visibility for improved safety. It also comes with standard cruise control, heated grips, and a 6.5-inch TFT touchscreen multi-information display EMID, with full color, providing immersive engagement with the machine systems. Additionally, it has Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and Bluetooth connectivity. For 2025, the Africa Twin Adventure Sports will be available in the following paint options, both featuring bold, big logo graphics, 